Hey YouTubers, so today I did a, this is a look that I rocked at IMAX 2012 in LA and I promised I would do a tutorial on the look because I really liked it. So it is definitely a smoky eye and there's lit glitters from Lit Cosmetics on here. I do the look, um, I'm going to do the look with just the smoky eye if you want to stop there you can stop there and then i do it with the glitter so hope you like the look and everybody take care okay so we're going to start with um this is black ground and this is a black paint pack from mac and i'm going to apply that with um this is from crown brush it's a c124 firm shadow brush I'm just so once you have that color on and we've winged it, this is this will act as our base. And I'm gonna apply Max Painterly Paint Pot with my Mac Concealer brush, and this is. Uh, 135 and I'm going to use this up under my brow area um, and so then I'm gonna take a brush and I can't find the brush that I used before where is the brush that I use? and I'm going to use this uh, Sigma brush just to Blend the two so it's not this harsh line. Okay, so now that you have your smoky eye base, I'm going to take, and we all know my favorite color, this is Texture from MAC as my transition color, and apply that just above the black. Okay, and then I'm going to use this color. I haven't, I got it, but I haven't talked about it in a while. It's from NARS, and the color is Night Clubbing. And it's actually like, it's a black, but it's like a gold, it's got some gold in it. And I'm gonna use a flat shader brush, and I'm going to pack the color on. And so you're not gonna wipe, you're just gonna pack it on. Pack it on your lid. So once you pack the color on, then you're gonna take um, a fluffy brush, and I'm gonna use my Sigma E25 brush. And you're just gonna to apply my highlight. What did I apply my highlight with? I'm gonna use another shader brush, and this is from the Naked Palette. I'm gonna use Virgin, but you can use or Brulee, whatever highlight color, rice paper that you want. And because I applied Max Panelli Paint Pot, I'm really getting a lot of color, so. And I actually bring my highlight in here a little bit. To go back in with texture and just get in that crease. Make sure you blend it well. Okay, so I have, this is a um, my designer brush and it's just a small short shader brush and I'm going to take that NARS color and I'm going to apply it on my waterline all the way across and I just okay and then I'm going to take a pencil brush and I'm just going to smudge it out Okay, so it just darkens the whole eye space. And then what I'm going to do is take a little blendy brush. And this is a just a silvery white color. This was actually the Gentle Fumes MAC Quad is the best buy ever. Um, just this white, and I'm gonna kind of put it in here. It's a little messy, but I'm gonna clean it up. Okay. I'm gonna put this in the inner to make the the inner of your eye pop.
Okay, and so now I'm gonna add my liner and I'm using the um, Wet n Wild um, Gel Liner brush. Okay, and now even though it's got some clear lines over here, once I add my concealer and everything, it won't be there, so it's very temporary. Okay, so that is it. Oh, I'm going to go under my eye, and this is from Makeup Forever, but you can use any black. It's um, their cold pencil. Waterline. Okay, so next I am going to, so that's it for the eyes. I'm going to add lashes at the end. So now I'm gonna get to my face. So my under eye concealer is the Max NC Studio um, Concealer, and that's an NC45, and I actually apply it with my uh, with my finger. Okay, and now because I have some blemishes. Um, like some brown spots. I'm actually going to use my concealer wheel from Ben Nye and I'm going to use um, this peach color to cover to cover up the black spots that I have from picking scars like you just pat this down before you apply your color and so I'm just gonna And this is great because you get like all the colors in this kit and I did get this also at IMAT. Okay, so now I have my under eye concealer. I'm going to apply my foundation. And as you know, I'm out of my Makeup Forever foundation. So I'm using my Graftobian, which I still like. And I'm using, um, it's almost to the end, this color and it is Deep Xanth. And I'm just going to apply it in my little areas around this. People are calling me. Now I use dark color for the outside area. I really need to get my makeup forever back. Maybe this weekend. Okay, and then I'm gonna take, um, and this is the Bedlam 953 brush, and I'm gonna blend all of this. Okay. And then to set the color, I'm going to use um, a big brush and I'm going to use, this is from MAC, this is a mineralized skin finish in dark. So on the under eye highlight, I'm going to add a color that's just a lot lighter than mine. Pull out the color in this area. So you just cover that area down here, down here, to help contour, and then blend it. And I'm going to take a lighter, this is from Mud, and this is Desert. So good. And now I'm going to do my contour, and this is a typical contour brush. I'm going to grab Blunt from MAC. Blunt, this big old circle right here. And then I'm going to grab a fluffy brush for this. Okay, so for my cheeks, I'm going to use Pink Spoon because I love it. Okay, so with a regular brush. And then I'm 
going to take a bronze color and this is glorified from MAC. look um, when I went to IMAX. I had on lashes. I'm going to put them on last. But the lady did jazz it up. So if you just want to do a smoky eye, um, I'm going to do a pale lip here. And that's all you want to do. This is just a pale lip. A new little gloss. Nothing special. Here's my finished look. I'm going to add lashes, but this is the look that I did for IMAX. And so if you're interested in adding glitter please stay tuned for how I'm using glitter this is what I got from lit cosmetics and it is a clearly liquid glitter base and I'm going to do it and it gave and in the kit it came with a brush so I'm gonna pull out the brush and the color that I am using from lit today is um, graphite I'm just gonna apply it on my lid to kind of jazz up the color Okay, and so you're gonna dip the pen in the color and then in the glitter. And then you just pack the color on. Ain't that bad? <laughs> that is bad. And so you just let that dry. And so then I'm gonna go back in and add the glue on the other side. Okay, and so I'm going to, they also gave us this rusty little this to let it dry. So when I come back, I will have this dried and have on lashes. Okay, so here is my finished look with the lit glitter and I added um, the lashes from Eyelore and they're double lashes, natural light. Love them. I know some people say they're just too much, but I like them, especially you. Now I don't have weave in my hair, and I'm back to my natural. I'm not used to not having hair, <laughs> so I like to have my face be fly. So hopefully you like this look. And